my channel, Marsha's Mush and Stuff. And if you are new here, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, ring the bell for notifications, and give a thumbs up. It definitely helps the channel to continue to grow and YouTube to notice me just a tad bit more. Thank you so much. And with all that being said, thank you to all of my original subscribers. I definitely appreciate each and every one of you. And that's my kitty cat. I wish I could pick her up, but I have a lap full of everything. Let me see if I can show her to you. Look how pretty she is. <laughs> But today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys and it is all about the signs at the Dollar Tree. You guys know what all you can do with those. So first we'll start out with a few other items I did grab. Haven't seen the 18 inch wreath form in quite a while so I did go ahead and grab it for a dollar. You just can't go wrong. And the 14 inch wreath form as well not our stores aren't getting in those really cool ones with the Chanel wires already attached and with that being said that's okay because I can use these all day long <laughs> so also they had these new face masks and I will go ahead and take it out of its package these, you guys, are not the same material that the other ones were in. So, you put it on like this. And this one has lips all over it. And it is so much more comfortable than the other ones, you guys. I may have that upside down. I'm not quite sure. But there you go. You get the gist. Bogging up my glasses, too. <laughs> But these are great. If you see them in your store, definitely pick them up. <clears throat> Sorry, my dog is whining. It's a game they play. I do apologize. I know they had this one last year because I actually made a wreath using bath sponges instead of the deco mesh. So I used those. I popped these on here and there. I wish I could find it and I would share it with you, but this is one of the older signs, but I love the cute little bunny head with the burlap bow, and these you can pull right off, and again, I love that they're only stapling them and not drilling those holes. You know, you know what I mean <laughs> if you craft. So, wanted to share these with you. Happy Easter with the pink truck, you guys, and check that out with the bunny tail. Absolutely so cute. The, the bunny is glittered. The eggs are not. So you could easily transform this to use all year round. It is in the pink. I did also grab it in the blue as well. So how cute is that? I think the blue one is my absolute favorite. But it does say Happy Easter, and there is the cotton tail. I believe the tails are a bit different. Well, the feet are definitely different. How cute are these? I absolutely love these. And I also picked one up for my aunt and my daughter as well. So there's a few for them. And then you guys, I ran across this. It says Cottontail Farms open daily, a dollar a dozen, this way to the bunny trail. How cute is that? And if you want it to DIY it, just flip it over. But that is so stinking cute. And they had it in blue as well. This one says Carrot Patch, pick your own, 25 cents each, locally grown, open daily. So there is that one as well. Guys, these are so stinking cute. Ask the managers when they get trucks in and that way you can time it perfectly so that you can get these great deals when they come out. Otherwise they get gone, they get scooped up so quickly you guys. So share that one with you. They had these lawn stakes as well. 
I never use them for that. You can easily disassemble them. It has Happy Easter with the truck that is cut out, so is that. So you could easily DIY this, but you can also use a protective sealant to put it outside. I would not just put it outside without some type of sealant because it is just that like MDF board but you could turn it around and if you did not like the blue or the bunnies you could do your own take you could even cut this part out and just have yourself a truck so how stunning and cute is that also you guys so sorry <laughs> so so excited today when I walked in and saw all of this cute Easter signs how cute is that one and she has and I say she because she's in pink it looks galvanized but it's not it's just the print but I love this barnwood look and her little feet are glittered but you know if and she has the little googly eyes and it just says happy Easter down through here I hope you guys can see that clearly it is so stinking cute I absolutely love it but if you are not a fan of this style they also had this one too how cute are those so I like this one better personally and they have the raffia bow right here as you see and this one is just it says happy Easter as well same same but if the bunny ears flopped over and it doesn't look galvanized but still the same wiggly googly eyes and again in pink and I do believe they had these in blue too I can't remember <laughs> I do have a shop with me that I will share these with you don't know when you'll see this but today is February 3rd so definitely wanted to get it out there to you again ask the managers at the Dollar Tree when they get their trucks that way give them a day or two to put it out and you can time it just right and then the welcome sign and it says every bunny welcome instead of everybody welcome every bunny welcome I love this one I do believe this is brand new Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below. And then, <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, check it out. It looks like a cutting board and it has the hardware and it's popping off. So you could easily remove that if you wanted to. But I like it the way it is. It says Cottontail and Company Egg Farm, Hippity Hoppity Lane, one mile ahead egg hunts daily so there you see that and they also had another style of this one fresh carrots 25 cents each locally grown cottontail farms a hundred percent organic how stinking cute I love the signs at the Dollar Tree excellent to craft with and again this one has the hardware in case you did not get to see that one either love both of these so much the glitter is shedding on me and then I did go ahead and pick up this cute one don't remember if it was out last year I'm trying to build up my craft stash and once Easter now I mean it's not over it's not even near time but this is galvanized so you can see that there the galvanized bunny with the uh, burlap bow and the little Easter eggs right here and it does say happy Easter in pink they did also have this one in blue and then another truck and guys let me grab this bag I did go ahead and pick up another six pack of the water because I'm going to continue on with that journey since I have seen so much progress from just drinking more water. 
So I also picked up this. I don't know how to pronounce it correctly. I will destroy it. But this is um, with stain shield, 12 small loads. But for me, it, it lasts quite a while. Mm, it smells so fresh, you guys. And I will let you know my thoughts. I've never had a problem with this product before, but you know, let me know in the comments below if you've used it, what you think about it. I've used it in the past and it's what I typically use, but I love this new one. Never seen it in my store before, so I grabbed that one. I did also grab some shampoo. Now, I will say some of the other shampoos are better, and but, you know, those weren't available, and I'm going to need shampoo very soon. So, I did go ahead and pick up these Salon Selectives. It is 16.1 ounce, and it is volume body shampoo as well. So, you can see that there. And, guys, again... This smells really good. It smells like what I remember Salon Selective smelling like in the past. I need to quit slumping over. <laughs> okay, and then I also grabbed the conditioner. Almost didn't, but I thought, why not? I mean, it gives you more volume. And again, 16.1 ounces. Uh, boost fullness and body. So that's great. I like my hair to look full even though I do have a lot of it so um, let me see oh sorry <laughs> so I did also want to share this with you every time I see these the mega my size paper towels you get 210 sheets and you select the size I always grab these they're not always around I usually grab two I just got one I'll probably regret it because I've been hunting these for about the past month or more so when you see those those are the best deal and another one of the cloth face mask now they're they are a little thin but i think perfect for summer and spring because i get super hot you guys so that definitely helped me and something that i had been looking for is by maybelline name brand mascara it's actually called snapscara and it is in the black cherry and often a snap um smooth clump free volume so hope you can see that there but my friend and i think it's pronounced sona if not i am so sorry sweetheart Correct me in the comments if I am wrong, but I will link her channel as well. She hauled this, so I was on the lookout for it. Passed it up the first time, saw it again, and said, nope, it's meant for me to have it, so I did grab it. Maybelline for a dollar, that's a great deal, and I will do a review video of what I thought about this. So look, look uh, for that to upload. <laughs> And by ringing the notification bell, you will be notified every time I upload a new video. <clears throat> and so, also just really quickly, just a couple more things. Um, I did grab one of these for my granddaughter who is starting to teeth. So, perfect for her, 0 to 18 months. You wash first and use warm water. Rinse thoroughly and place it in the refrigerator for several hours and she lost the first one so i grabbed her another one she's only five months going on six months and these you guys are excellent the chocolate uh fusion they are gourmet chocolate covered biscuits 3.6 ounces and they are delicious a nice treat and dark chocolate is good for you by the way so love those and also picked up some florals for DIY. I want to do how pretty are these. It is the lavender. <clears throat> and it has white and purple in it. I thought that was ever so pretty. 
and then also the purple lavender pick the dark purple they also had light purple but I think this is a good combination together again I love doing floral arrangements and just a couple more items you guys and we are done so I did grab myself one of these chalk writers in the color pink it's great for chalkboards dry erase windows glass mirrors ceramic and metal so it's wet erasable mess and dust free so again in crafter square and pink I was thinking Easter of course with the haul and then these little miniature palettes I have never seen these before in my store so I did grab a couple of those to DIY with or whatever make little risers out of I'm not quite sure yet what I'm going to do with them but I will share that project with you when I do it and then last but not least I'm going to lay those by you I did pick up this chunky wood piece they're just calling it a wood wood hanging decor but you could always fill that hole in and to me guys it looks like a book and that is exactly what I was thinking about with this I think that would make an excellent DIY and I love crafting so with all that said that is it you guys so I will let you know what I think of the products and until the next time thank you so much for watching I appreciate each and every one of you have a wonderful and blessed day bye